everyone and welcome to another video. For those of you who are new to my channel, hi, my name is Brenda and today I'm really excited to share this video with you. So unlike most of my videos where I swatch or review nail polishes, this time I'm going to be sharing with you my experience and thoughts about the new product by NBM, The Cuticle Body. So this is a product that has pretty much taken my Instagram feed by a storm. If you're a nail content or nail art creator, you've probably seen this everywhere. Like literally tons of people has been using it and in all honesty, I have been very curious about it. I was lucky enough to get some free samples from the owner early this month so I could try them out and just share my opinion with you. So here I am today ready to share with you all my thoughts about this product. So I did get this one early this month but I wanted to give it some time so I could try it out and just gather my thoughts and opinions about it before I share it with you because as you know, I want to give it a few reviews. So I do have a lot of details that that I'm going to be sharing with you today. It's going to be a little bit of a lengthy video but I promise it's worth it. It has a lot of information so please don't skip any parts and watch until the end. I don't want to make the intro too long so we are going to get started but before we continue please don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of my uploads. So I'm gonna show you what I've received. The first one is the tangerine one, which is the orange, and this one is the best seller. And then I also received the green one, which is probably people's not favorite, that's what she told me at least, but this is actually the one that I have been using the most, so I'm going to base all my review on this one, which is the one that I have been using. She also included a written note and a little extra gift in there, which actually a lot of people was getting for their purchase, Anyways, I wanted to say real quick that I have been doing this little challenge which is 30 days of using the cuticle body and as you can see here by the time that I'm filming this review I have done up to 19 days so I have been using it every day. I would say I'd use it at least twice a day so I do use it frequently. Right before I deep dive into my review, I just want to give you a general overlook of the product. So this is the box where it comes and it just has tons of information on it. It tells it's cruelty free, paraben free, among other important details. It also tells you where the product is sourced from. So for those of you who like to know where things come from and all that, the information is provided. Also in the back, it's telling you what is inside. And also you have a long list of all kinds of oils that compound this cuticle body uh, somebody asked me because I asked if you had any questions about you know is this safe to apply like if you're eating and you like just some of it gets in your mouth to be honest just looking at the ingredients and seeing that most of them are organic and just considering the minimal amount that will make it to your mouth from you eating I would say that I don't think this is gonna hurt you you know these are just general questions because I know some people wonder about it but just in general just make sure you wash your hands before you eat so keep that in mind so the product itself comes in this very vibrant and beautiful case which is you know very pretty but it also it slides out so if you don't want to have the carrying around feature you can just have the beautiful glass bottle it also has a beautiful wooden cap and it has those stones inside so of course you can find all these details on the website but the glass and the wood just look very elegant and pretty so i really like that and then of course if you want to be carrying it around which is mostly what the idea is with this product which is so very innovative you can also hook the strap to different things that you carry with you your backpack your purse your water bottle uh, there is all kind of things you can hook it on i personally have it attached to my wallet because that's the one thing i never leave the house without all right so i want to make this review as fair as possible and first i feel like in order to give you a review of this product i need to give you a little bit of the background of the health of my nails as you see here in this clip my nails and cuticles have always been in a very good health i have always taken good care of them and i have been using cuticle oils every day not necessarily this brand in the past but for the review i was using only this cuticle oil just to see you know if i would notice any difference so first off i will say 
I file down my nails every single week. I like to have them in perfect shape, so every time that I do a new manicure or so, I make sure that I file them down so they look pretty much the same. As you can see, both hands look equally. I care for both of my hands the same way, so as you see in this clip, they are both looking in great shape. And the reason for me telling you this is so you know that while I was using this product, my nails continued to be healthy and they continued to grow. And it's probably something that's not very noticeable because I filed them down. But for the most part, my nails just stayed in perfect conditions. My cuticles were always hydrated and I really like how it functioned and how it continued to give me good cuticle health. And now I just want to say, so in order for me to give you a fair review on this product, I also felt like it was appropriate to compare it to other cuticle oils that I use or have used in the past. Of course, the main focus of this review is going to be the cuticle body. So I'm going to be giving you more details about these than I will be giving you on others. So I would strongly suggest for you to watch this video until the end because I'm going to be telling you what I like the most. And I also want to bring some suggestions to the brand, which, you know, I always do whenever I do my reviews, I would always tell you what I like the most. And if I see chance for improvement, then I'm also going to be mentioning that in the most respect way. So my ultimate favorite has always been the Essie Apricot Oil. This is the one that I have been buying over and over and over again. So there's one thing that I heard people mentioning about the price. So when you compare this to in price, the price is actually the same. However, you have a different amount of product in each of them. So the cuticle body only has eight and if I'm not wrong, Essie has about 12. Now you also have to stop and think that the NBM is a new brand, so there's a lot that goes involved whenever you are launching a new brand and Essie has been around forever. Plus also, if you buy the NBM, you are supporting a small business. I don't feel like the price is a deal breaker and I'm gonna just give you more details about what I like the most about the cuticle body and what I like or not like about my usual oil products. So unlike most of the products that you have seen that are for cuticles, you have probably seen that these ones include brushes. This is not the case for the cuticle body because this one has a little roller on the top, which is actually very practical because when you have it on the go, you don't have to take out a brush or anything like that. And then you get a little bit of oil in there and it's just like the perfect amount. Of course, you can like build it up if you want extreme hydration, but in my case, I just need a little bit. One thing that I want to say is that when I compare this to my other favorite cuticle oil is that the one by Essie is extremely oily, like extremely oily. And I know that it looks like I'm very, being very generous in this video, but this is actually how it is. So even when I try to get a little amount, I always end up with these very greasy oils. Once you see them side by side, you can see what I'm talking about. So usually whenever I use the one by Essie, I would end up just leaving the oil in everything I touch. That was not the case with the one by NBM. So that is something very important. I know a lot of people has this problem that they don't use certain oils because they would just leave marks everywhere. And yeah, that's the disadvantage that I have with the one by Essie. Another great thing that I don't wanna miss out before we move on in this video is that these oils are scented but it's not an overwhelming smell. I personally hate strong smells. I can't stand it. Just to be honest with you, I don't even like candles because of that reason. You won't see a candle in my house unless it's just for decor. I don't like things that are like strongly scented and that is what I like about this cuticle oil is that I don't have that problem with it. Because I just find that to be very, very nice. And so this is the point where I would compare it to other cuticle oil products that I have tried before. So this one right here is by Burt Bees and this is the reason why I don't like it. First off, I just don't like the fact that, you know, I had to rub it off to put it on my nails. I just don't like that. I don't feel that that is very practical. I also do not like the smell of it at all. Some of you probably love their products, but I do not like any of their products because of the smell. So smell plays a huge factor for me. That would definitely be a deal breaker. If the cuticle body had like a strong smell or something, I would probably not like it, but I don't have that issue because it's just a nice smell. So I just wanted to point that out. Okay, so now we're gonna touch on more like obvious features. So first off, what I really, really like about the cuticle body is how convenient it is to be carrying it around. Like I have shared these on my Instagram stories a lot. So 
I actually use it. I don't want you to think that I'm just being super positive because it was sent to me. I have actually gotten to try it and experience these new products. So that is something that I really like. I carry it around. I have one in my water bottle. But I take it with me to the gym and I recently opened the orange one so I can have it hooked up on my wallet. So first off, the size is perfect. It also, you know, has the very bright color that actually catches your attention. This is just like having a water bottle with you. Like whenever you see a water bottle in your desk, then you immediately kind of feel thirsty. So whenever I see my cuticle body on my desk or wherever I am, then I am like, oh, I should oil right now you know if you want to have healthy nails then you probably would want to oil frequently as i said i do it maybe two times a day or so so that is a great feature that the colors are so bright that they are always calling your attention and that just kind of calls you to to oil your cuticles and of course you can just hook this up on your water bottle or your wallet or your purse or you can even put it on your pants like if you're going somewhere you don't want to be carrying around anything on your hands you can just put it in there it's, it's super lightweight caring for your cuticles is that important with you and you would like to carry it with you everywhere then that's an option and it really wouldn't bother you because it's such a tiny item that you know it wouldn't take that much space so I do want to say a couple of things that I do feel like it would make this product better. Not necessarily that I think it's necessary. And my one suggestion, which is something that I'm hoping that maybe the NBM team is working on, is that they come up with different colors. Because as much as I like the bright colors because they caught your attention and then, you know, it kind of gets you to oil your nails frequently, I also feel like it would be really nice to have more like neutral colors like nude colors because I know not everyone likes these very bright colors that stand out so maybe if we wanted something more elegant this is just a suggestion which I think like will give the brand like a little bit of opportunity to grow So as I said, if you are just like an average consumer, the cuticle body is great because as I said, the roller feature makes it really easy to apply. However, if you're somebody like me who films videos all the time and wants to oil up in between, I do like the idea of having a brush because whenever you have a brush like this one, you have control of where the oil is going to go. So once again, if you're just like an, a normal consumer, then you wouldn't even worry about it. I have to make sure that whenever I am applying oil in between layers of nail polish, I don't get it on my nail because I don't want that to affect the performance of the polish. So that would be like the only thing that I would say about the whole roller against brush situation. But for the most part, if I'm just carrying it around with me whenever I go places then I don't have to even worry about it because by then my nails would be dry and that's just something I wouldn't worry about and lastly if you have been wondering what nail polish I'm wearing because I honestly I'm so in love and obsessed with this polish. This one is by Wildflower Lacquer. And this is a polish that I got from the Hella Handmade Creation with website, which I have talked about before. I think this was part of like their July release. So I did have it for a while, but I didn't get to try it until now. And I absolutely love it. Alrighty, and that is everything that I wanted to share with you today. Believe it or not, I still managed to forget a couple of things. So first off, I want to say that if you purchased your cuticle body and you're running low, you can also get the big refill bottle, which would help you to refill your little cuticle body four times. So I think that is an amazing idea because it's environmentally friendly and you don't have to be getting tons of little bottles when you can just get the big refill ones. Another thing is about the land jars that I mentioned at the beginning. Whenever I received mine she was sending them out for free with every product you purchase and now they are available for purchase in different colors so you can also match it with your little cuticle body so that is something nice and one more thing whether you decide to buy just one also keep in mind that whenever you buy two it's a better deal because you get two of them for $20 and you also get free shipping so that's also something to keep in mind so overall my thoughts were very positive about this product as I said it is firmly 
something new and I think that she's doing an amazing job with this. Of course, as you saw in my video, I also mentioned that one thing that I would like to see in the future from them. I know she's coming up with different products to add on to the brand, so that would also be nice to see. So after seeing my review and if you would like to see more about the brand, I would strongly suggest for you to check their Instagram page and also check out their website. I'm going to be leaving those links below so you can read more about this product and just see about the overall experience that everyone is having with it. So I guess that is everything that I wanted to share with you. I want to hear your opinions in the comment section. Just let me know if you have seen it before or if this is the first time that you have ever heard of this product and what do you think about it overall. So thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you would like to see more videos and also don't forget to give this one a thumbs up. Thank you much and I will see you on the next one. Goodbye.